some very interesting fact that is published on WebMD on internet that says that they found that lotus is decreasing swelling, killing the cancer cells and bacteria, uh, reduces the blood sugar, it helps to break down the fat, protect the heart and blood vessels and protect the skin, liver and brain. So, I mean, whatever is known about lotus is already so fascinating. And this is actually lotus, the material, the actual flower used as a medicine. Now, how I have used lotus, well, for everything that's written over here, I can give you a story. It's so, so good. So for example, someone has chronic backache. I usually get lots of such patients. You know, the whole back is aching or middle back or lower back. And as they wake up in the morning, you know, the whole body is paining. Very interesting. Take the lotus flower remedy for one or two months continuously. And there's a very good possibility that within three to four weeks, the backache almost disappears. The reason, the reason for backache is your muscles very tight in the morning. And what's your muscles are for? Not just movement. They store your emotional memory. They respond to your emotions. If you are stressed out, just watch your posture. Subconsciously, you tighten your muscles. Muscles store also the memories. So when you give lotus flower remedy, in your dreams, there's a possibility a lot of these suppressed emotions get released. You get dream, you cry, everything is gone. You wake up in the morning lighter, less pain. And within a few weeks, everything is gone. So chronic backache, I inspire people to try lotus flower remedy. You have to take it orally, tea drops three times a day for a few weeks. If you have long standing ailments, lots of ailments with constant weakness, and you're really exhausted, you've suffered, you've you're already on a lot of medication, that time lotus comes up, you know, as a great help, slowly, slowly helping you rejuvenate your system. You need to take it for a long, long time to completely recover. But even in first week itself, you may start feeling better. For your digestive system, because our solar plexus is the Manipur chakra, it's the sun chakra. And lotus is the sun loving flower. So lotus and the sun relationship is very strong. In the morning, it opens in the night. I mean, it is closed. So same with our solar plexus, very strong connection. And any digestive issue, you can try. You may see some kind of detox that may happen. Initially, you may see your stool color is darker and because all the detox toxins are going out of your system. And within a few weeks, you will see a beautiful, nice, natural, deep yellow, oranges color. And you realize that the detox has completed. Skin issues. Skin is the largest detox organ, perspiration, you know. <clears throat> so when your kidney cannot function and, you know, release the toxins, your skin takes over and starts releasing the toxins. The lotus is a great detox flower that helps this detox process. And you'll find your skin issues slowly going away. We don't apply anything local. We just want to take it orally and have complete internal cellular cleansing. <clears throat> then injuries, healing injuries faster. The moment injury happens, it's beautiful that body also knows how to heal. And the body's own intelligence takes over and tries to heal. Lotus helps immediately in this intelligence to heal it faster. If it's six weeks fracture, let's do it in three weeks. I myself done it. I had a small fracture. In three weeks, the cast was out and I was walking back again very fast within three weeks. Post-operative -op recovery, obviously, you have scar, uh, you have weakness. This will also help a lot. Then anxiety, stress, depression, obsessive compulsive neurosis, brain fog, mental fatigue, mood-related disorders. Because the vibrations or the energy of lotus is same as our 
क्राउन चक्र सहस्त्रार चक्र एंड लॉर्ड ऑफ मेंटल इलनेसेस आर सपोर्टेड ग्रेजुअली दे गो अवे आल्सो कंप्लीटली व्हेन यू टेक लोटस फ्लावर बिकॉज इट अलाइंस ऑल योर चक्रास द बैलेंसिंग एंड अलाइनमेंट ऑफ ऑल द चक्रास देयर आर सेवन मेजर चक्रा देयर आर मेनी माइनर चक्रा देयर आर आल्सो चक्रा अबव अप टू 14 so depending on which system you follow the lotus has this most powerful capacity to first start aligning all your chakra once you align all your chakra the energy flow is much easier and detox happens and mentally and emotionally you start grounding you start getting clarity and you can also meditate much better as i said quick and gentle physical and emotional detox as and when whenever you need just take a drop three drops right on your tongue and within minutes you will find some negative thought will just quickly go away if you are an acupuncturist or acupressurist you can also apply lotus locally one one drop on those points body will quickly absorb the information and start working just like how you do acupuncture and acupressure and also for newborn babies i would love because you know it's a shock suddenly you are out completely in a new environment although mother is right near right next to you you are still you know adjusting a cord is cut and new way of existing lotus flower remedy on the belly button or around the belly button quickly just few times and you know the baby starts feeling more grounded animals respond very quickly so uh, sometimes uh, bonding with the family bonding between two animals there yeah, there is this jealousy there is sometimes <laughs> violence all these situations also we use lotus flower in case if you want to do a uh, pujas and prayers or you want to clear up the energy of a space or if you want to a new home and you are staying over there or you are in a hotel room and you want to clear up the negative energy there you can just use lotus spray very easy within minutes the space will become clear and you will have lotus energy in it in my own clinic like i have uh, paints yeah? uh, all the walls are painted and while the painting was going on i made sure that i put different different flower energies in different different rooms according to what healing i wanted lotus is one of the most powerful flower on this planet the reason uh, it took birth it is one of the first flower that took birth from the vishnu's navel and the brahma you know was born on the lotus leaf and many of our deities also have lotus along with them the reason because that's the energy the same energy as the deity is also with the flower so it's very powerful very spiritual very deeply acting and you can feel the energy of lotus when you visit a lotus pond if you sit by the lotus pond decide to meditate you will feel the energy directly you can also use it if there is a homeopathic treatment going on uh, while the patient is not improving i always add lotus flower and that it enhances the effect of other therapies also so uh, you can just add on so that now the prescribed remedies work even better then aroma therapy massage those who are naturopath they have mud packs in the bath water everywhere lotus flower is definitely helping to clear up the energy and assisting in the process of healing you also do reiki healing or any distant healing you can ask the patient to take lotus remedy every day while the healing is going on this will enhance the effect of it Uh, if you are a healer or if you are a uh, you know gifted person you are a very sensitive person you can sense energy you are into uh, vastu or reiki healing or uh, you sense the energy of the people or you know surroundings you read thoughts you have psychic abilities then if you want to develop or enhance these abilities lotus is your friend you regularly take lotus flower it will stabilize your own energy field and help you learn this uh, new sciences this from intuitive intuitive level also from the universal consciousness 
uh, tapping records from the Akashic uh, field, wherever you want to, you can do this much better when you yourself take lotus flower remedy. Lots of healers suffer from burnout. That I have seen through the years. I, I have a very compassionate heart. I'm very kind. I want to heal everybody. So when I was a new healer, I really wanted to heal the whole world. And I would do, and I would do, and I would overdo. And I would forget about myself, and then there's a burnout. And often the people who need your energy are very sick. They really take a lot out of you. And because you are so kind, loving, compassionate, you end up giving. There's a lot of transference, transference of energy that happens. We call it as empathetic transference, and you may fall sick. So your first duty is to your own self. Healers, please heal thyself. You need to be in the best of the condition. Then only you can heal. You can't live on credit cards. You need your own reserves. So I inspire healers to really do this every single day. To first replenish their own reserves. Heal themselves. Not take anything from their patients. And really stay very clear and focused. Uh, belly button, because... Again, belly button is 72,000 different nadis from there. It's a very powerful point. When we apply lotus flower remedy just around the belly button, we call it as nabi. It balances your whole body. They call it as pechuti balancer, right? Mm -hmm. there are people who actually do that. So this flower instantly wants to help you in a very balanced fashion. There are people who get constipation, diarrhea, backache, uh, excessive menstrual bleeding or acidity, vomiting, all just because this Nabi has shifted because of some wow. activity. So we tell them to just apply around the belly button on a regular way. Instantly also it will work and it also works those who have chronically out kind of Nabi center. And I already mentioned the meditation support. Those who want to stay in touch with who they are. Then lotus. Why? Because <clears throat> the life of a spiritual being is like that of lotus. Lotus grows in the mud and yet it is untouched. It's extremely pure. It knows how to transform the mud into beautiful flower. Same way the life of a spiritual being is like that of lotus, though in the world, in the maya, and yet untouched by the maya, remaining detached. Taught in Bhagavad Gita, the same thing. Practice detachment. And we keep asking how, how. Who are the spirits here for a physical experience? You are not the physical body. You're just there for a temporary experience. So in your spiritual journey, in you being in touch with who you are, Lotus helps you to be there. To remember to be 24-7, that enlightenment kind of awareness starts expanding as you do. It helps in your spiritual journey. And in general, enthusiasm, creativity in life, being very alive, celebrating and thriving. All this on the planet are growing and have never thought of making profit. Everything in nature never make profit. We are the only beings on this planet who think of making profit. They just give. They just be. And if we can learn to just be, it would be wonderful. This is fascinating, Doctor.